bone. Nice. We'll read the item description in a moment. Wait, is this not the path that I was supposed to take? I thought it was. Oh no, that's the path I'm supposed to take. I put the home bone on my uh, on this bar. Actually, I don't need that. I don't need that right now. Switch that to a home bone. There you go. Bone fragment reduced to white ash. That looks nice. Return to last bonfire. Use for resting or to or to the shrine bonfire. That's interesting. I guess there's a special oh shrine like firelink shrine maybe. Bonfires are sustained by the bones of the undead. In rare cases, the previous owner's strong urge to seek bonfires enchants their bones with a homeward instinct. Yep. Sounds pretty much like Dark Souls 1. This is too bright. I can't see. Like, the contrast is is killing me. I bet there's an enemy here, and I'm not going to be able to see him. Well, this guy's getting kicked off the edge. really only one thing to do with that guy. The amount that you can walk on these rocks and stuff feels different than Dark Souls 1. I don't know what to do. Okay, not bad. Cleric Sacred Chime. Oh, he's a cleric? Wait, I thought he was shooting a crossbow. <laughs> so it shows what I know. Hey, look at that! Look at this weird little shortcut. Why they put that there? Wait. So this path upwards has just like a lot of little branches? No, not falling death, a falling kill. I think my health bar is huge because I became a quote unquote host of embers. That's my guess. In human form, you get some extra extra HP. Why did they put this here? Is this to give you a, a spot to look back and see what you've missed? I guess killing the boss made me a host of embers. Is that is it like Demon Soul style, where you have to kill a boss to get human? Well, sure, I guess a cleric can shoot a crossbow, but usually clerics are too religious for that. There's a lot of weird little branching paths here, but none of them are going anywhere, especially. Like some minor items. Is there a guy there? There's a decent amount of like, visual noise. I don't feel like... I see these branches. These branches look like those dudes in cloaks just kind of sitting there. What is this now? Why why is this here? Why is all this here? There's no paths here. Welcome back. There's a thing over there. I mean, I guess I should go this way. Take a look. Huh. Hmm. I May mean, always run the risk of running into some weird tough enemy. Pretty sure that's a guy up there. Though I don't know if it's a guy or an NPC or a enemy. So how the heck do you get up in that tree? Would you just walk up it? 
Let's see what this blood stain says. Is that, guy, is that gonna be some guy who tried to jump into the tree and died? Wait, where is it? Hmm. Is it doing the thing where it doesn't show? Nice, Shane, nice. That's a phantom. Still not as much damage as a, as a parry, a repost. East West Shield, nice! I like the East West Shield in uh, Original Souls. I liked it a lot, actually. So let's see. Oh, can't equip. Look at that. So we're looking at lower durability. Compare. Oh, look at that. Hot. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Parry, parry, okay. Weight is lower. Durability is lower. Then again, I'm barely using it. So I might as well. Uh, where is the um, absorption? Ah, 86% to 55%. But I've been. haven't really been using it either, so. Here we go. Whoop! Look what I found. <laughs> they didn't tell me about that. I don't know if I want to fight whoever that is. I'm kind of... Let's look around here a little bit more, I guess. That might have been a plunge attack opportunity on a guy before. An ember? What is that? This is, gonna, is this the equivalent of a humanity item? It even looks the same. Gain strength of flame, boosting HP until death. Ah. Interesting. So unkindled is you don't have any. Hmm. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, it even looks like a humanity. Ah! Look, with the strength of fire, the summoning signs of unkindled become visible, and seekers of embers can be summoned to join in cooperation. But beware, the embers may also attract invaders. This is a clearly human form, and that's clearly the shape of humanity. Alright, so I'm in human form. So killing a boss makes you human. Cracking a humanity item, or sorry, an ember item, looks like it also makes you human, or em host of embers, or whatever. New, new fangled lingo we want. Okay, so I'm, I'm back here. Don't think I want to go in there yet. I'm going to look around. Hey, for alligator fish. Welcome back. A dog! Oh god. Dog's got some HP. I couldn't one shot it. It's like a crazy zombie dog. Usually dogs come in packs. Wait, packs of cards. Oh, look at that. More embers. Good. I bet I'm going to need a lot of these. So I'm glad they're giving me these. Because it looks like you lose quite a bit of HP. Also, four ring slots, right? Four ring slots. Wait. What is... 
this? Oh, it's your covenant item. Ah, look at that. I don't know about cute, man. I don't know about that. Okay, so... I can go... I can go up into inside the main thing, but I actually... I think I will go on to the left and take a look at that one guy who was up ahead. He's probably going to be some... He's going to be a harder enemy, I can tell. Because he's standing out in the open looking like he's expecting me. Oh boy, here he comes. Oh god, what is this? Huh? At least him. He oh, that's his parry move. Let's hope this works. to die. Wait, I'm out? Oh boy. This suddenly got really bad. I don't think I'm gonna beat this guy. There it is. Wow, that guy knows the business. Cool. I'm out of the first try club. Yep. Wolnir's crown. The Cartus Conqueror. See if I can make it back to my stuff. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely lost a lot. So how much of this can I go past? Also, do I try fighting him again? This entire path seems clean. There's nobody here. Unless you stray from it. Oh. Woo, bleed! No, he didn't bleed me out. He just he cuts through. Oh, man, I can't block that. Hmm, interesting, Avalander. You didn't die to that guy? Interesting. I think parrying him is going to be my path to success. But luckily, I can just run past all this stuff and get my souls. This, uh, Ronin. We're gonna call him the Ronin. And my health does not seem to be going down and down and down, which is good. This is gonna be good parry practice, I guess. Oh god, my souls are way up here. Oh! 
Okay, do your thing. He just goes right through that. He has all kinds of moves too. Keep going. Nope. Now would be your time to attack me, guy. I screwed that up bad. I thought he was going for an attack. Oh, <laughs> I can't believe I got away from that jump. I didn't expect him to do a jump either. What happened there? He got a lot of my health from... I can't knock him out of stuff. The parry train ended pretty quick. What's up, Street Trash? Welcome to the stream. Hey, Mr. Flaz. Hey, Nombi Weasel. Welcome back. Hey, QMBS. Welcome back to you, too. It's nice to see so many people come out after... After I haven't seen them for a long time. 34, like, I haven't had 34 people watch me in, like, five years. No, it can't be five years. At least two. Oh god, I'm gonna have to go up there and fight this guy like in his face in order to get my souls back. I may as well just give up these souls, I, I guess. Maybe it's not worth it. That was supposed to be a plunge attack, you dork. I guess you can't do like these instant plunge attacks like before. I need to I have to use my souls or distance myself from that guy. I don't want to I don't want to lose my souls. Maybe I'll go up there and get my stuff and go. Kill a bunch of dudes. There's 7000 or something. I got a bunch from killing that Udex. I don't want to lose those. Bloodborne, Bloodborne. Yeah, I guess maybe during Bloodborne, huh? Yeah, I suppose. Definitely didn't have... I don't think I had this many people watching me during DLC. Bloodborne DLC, though. Maybe? Maybe briefly during raids. cannot block that stuff. The other thing I can't do... I'm gonna run back so at least my souls are in a better place. What, he's... The partial parry is... Did he jump off the edge? No. That's a bat. Oh man. I can't. I can't read him yet. So I keep going early on the parries because I keep thinking of, about him doing that fast attack. <sighs> hey, Smurfy. Ooh, Smurfy got purged. That's interesting. Wouldn't have expected that. Oh, yeah, the Bloodborne DLC had the baby there. Wait, did it? 
When did it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. That's right. Oh, I should I should buff up before I go up there at least. Put on my um fight fight skills. What do we call them? Put on my fight skills, yeah. Come on, now we're ready. That sounds like it's bleeding. This I feel exactly like I'm fighting some some crazy PvP here. This is exactly what it feels like to fight a regular Katana user. Dude! I am, like, unless I get all the parries, I'm not well equipped to fight this guy. I can't stagger him out of stuff, he, he attacks fast. Kick him off the cliff. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. No, this is stupid. I'm not going to fight this. I'm going to get my stuff and go. I'm not going to fight that guy. I'm done with him. I'm going to come back with a sword... As tall as I am, I'm just running attack, smash him into the ground. I really, I really should get better in my parries, but I'm not gonna. I, the cliff is there, but I don't think I can. I don't think I'm gonna be able to. I do have to go up here and get my stuff, though. That's one way to do it. Oh, he dropped something! He dropped something and I want it! I did notice twice in a, in a row that when I first got up there, he went up there, he walked onto that little corner piece. Like, he's waiting for me to do that. <laughs> Uh, what's up, Chronologic? Welcome back. I hope whatever he was carrying remains there for me. He also gave me 2,000 souls, which is a decent amount. I also hope he doesn't respawn. I have a lot of things that I... We all have things we want. Oh! I think I got everything! I think I got everything I wanted! Oh, I got an Uchi! Not that I want Master's Attire, huh? I'm definitely not going to be using this, but sweet! That's how you can get the Uchi early in the game, wow. Cuts flesh like butter. It causes bleeding, but breaks easily as a result. Like, how easily? Hmm. Oh, skill hold. Assuming a holding stance to rapidly execute a lunging slash with normal attack. Or a deflecting parry with strong it. Whoa! Hey, these are cool. Well, I think I kind of cheesed them, honestly. What about his sweet clothes? What, what does he got there? Nothing on his head. A terribly worn shirt. Men are fond of weaving tales to explain the raggedness of their garb. My sixth sense warned me of danger, and I danced between flurries of blades, unscathed, but alas, my clothes went to tatters. Wait. Oh. <laughs> Nothing on his legs. <laughs> and now I am the master. No item can be lost forever. That's a tip in and of itself. I didn't know that. This is going to be open for the other side for sure. Definitely a... Uh... Hey, spoilers now. I'm not up there yet. I'm not up to Firelink Shrine. That's true. There is no there is no wrong way to do this in Dark Souls. Well, look at all these. Half of these are me. Message from Armiter. The Ornstein look-alike. He's asking me something. I don't think I have that yet. I don't think I'm there yet, and I kind of wish there, I didn't know that. Well, I guess we don't know how much of a look-alike he is. That's sad.
Sounds like a Katana user. <laughs> Looks like an NPC. Disparage the message. Yeah. Ooh, I like this new rating. Up and down. Whoa. This is cool. This looks like... It's like the, that looks like the friggin' Lord Vessel. Am I in the... I'm not in the kiln, am I? No. No, this isn't the kiln. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. I'm a firekeeper. I tend to the flame and tend to thee. She doesn't sound like the previous voice actresses. The lords have <coughs> left their thrones and must be delivered. I like this music. To this end, I am at thy What's up, I'm gonna downvote anything that doesn't give me a useful piece of information, Clue. Ashen one, to be unkindled is to be a vessel for souls. Sovereignless souls will become thy strength. She does it without stuttering at all. I will show thee how. Wait, what's that over there? Is that Andre? Ashen one, bring me souls plucked from their vessels. Plucked from their vessels. Ashen one. To be sovereign, I will show Ashen One. Mm. Very well. Then touch the darkness within me. Wow. Come on, Maiden in Black. What's up? Hey, Crestfallen Warrior over there. Ooh, I can get a lot of levels. I also started an hour early, Shinkuro, so. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you can have three weapons in each side. Doesn't help me, Harima. Doesn't help me at all. What's up, Ikatuff? Is she mumbling? Has anybody figured out what she's saying? <laughs> Try advice, fatty. <laughs> Seems straightforward. One point each. I don't like the split, unfortunately. But, oh well. I have tons of HP. I don't think I need more. I do need... I do need stamina. So how many... How many I can get? 12 to 21. Get nine levels. I have sixteen strength. That's pretty good, especially two-handing. I can get over twenty. So we're gonna go four, 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 one. Again. This gives me a, a reason to up. Hold on. Oh yeah, look at that. It gives me five more points.
Mm. Well, it's steady because I'm not doing anything. If I do this, it's gonna... It's gonna change stuff. It shouldn't be my PC either. PC should be fine. Network norm generally should be fine. I don't know. Ah. It's to hope, I guess. Farewell, Ashen One. May the flames guide thee. That sounds familiar. Wait. Oh, here we go. Uh, sure. Okay, that's earlier. That's where I am now. I like that it tells me. <laughs> oh, you can always go to Firelink Shrine. Hmm. So it looks like you can warp. It looks like you might be able to warp within areas only. I'm not sure. We'll find out more. Definitely see somebody that looks like Andre over there. Even from this distance, it looks like Andre. Ah, another yeah. one roused from the sleep of death. Well, you're not alone. We unkindled are worthless. Can't even die right. <laughs> Gives me conniptions. And it have us seek the lords of Cinder and return huh. to their molding thrones. Huh. But we're talking true legends with the metal to link the fire. Yeah, I've done that before. We're not fit to lick their boots. Huh. Uh huh. Don't you think? Nice. <laughs> What a sick joke. <laughs> Asking us to seek the Lords of Cinder. They're talking true legend. Let's go have a little chat with Andre. Oh, we have a lot of people around here. Alright, Haima. It's cool. It we have plenty of mods. No. <laughs> Ashen one. Shrine handmaid. If my wares are not to thy satisfaction, bring me umbral ash. Mm -hmm. With ash, I oh. fashion new wares. Is it not our sorry fate to sup on death? Hmm. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Knowest thou of that soppy gossip? Hmm? That cordial intrusion layeth the path to embers. What? And You're so talking about jolly cooperation? Yes. Ashen one. Then thy pockets will overflow with souls. That, that's a good hint. They don't tell you about that in Dark Souls 1. 
how good co-op is for um, souls and stuff. Ashen one, bring with is it not? <laughs> Sell item. Whoa. Okay, you can buy embers for twenty five hundred. That's quite a bit. Repair powder, useful. Purple moss clump, could be useful. Prism stones, ooh. Soul arrow, tower key, key to the dilapidated tower behind the shrine. That costs 20,000, so there's usually going to be another way to get there. Oh, well, there's a dried finger. Should only be used with the greatest caution. Allow allowing the summoning of a third phantom, but also a second dark spirit. Whoa, what? Oh, look at that. White sign soapstone. It only costs 500. Unlimited use. Yo, I should just, I just buy that. Home bones. Baron Dart. Interesting. Is it coming to uh, X-Bone Archvile? And if so, yes, absolutely. I haven't played it because I was waiting for it to come to um, X-Bone. Torch, Talisman, Sorcerer's Staff, Halberd, nice. DD. Crimson Parma. That's uh, Dark Souls 2. Shield. Warriors round shield. shield. Blah, blah, blah. Oops. So she sells the white sign soapstone. That's weird. So what is the umbral ash that she wants? She'd only give me 500 for that? They're not. I guess it's not that good. One, be sure to bring more souls. <laughs> Trade your souls? Wait, what now? What? What does that mean? This is, this Firelink Shrine area looks really big. There's a lot of stuff going on here. It's more like a big old hall. Also, Andre sounds a little bit sounds kind of weak. Compare this sound to how he sounds in Dark Souls One. Well. A newcomer, I see. It sounds like him. Yup. Oh, nice, Archvile. That's great. Weapons. You're in search of the Lords of Sindhu, I trust. I don't know if it's the same voice actor. Journey, I, wager. You'll require good arms. I have good arms. They're on me right now. Let me smith you weapons. I am a smith. Such is my purpose. A lot Estes. Hmm. Weapons and protection are sturdy enough by and large. But when overused, they'll eventually... Oh, I gotta repair. I need to buy a smith box. When their durability is low, repair becomes a necessity. Use a powder or simply rest... A Wait, what now? But ha! Just rested a bonfire. Bring them me. I'll hammer them back into shape. They take no pleasure in breaking, I assure you. <laughs> so handle them with care if you would. I like this guy's dialogue. In fact, I like all the dialogue in this game so far. Simple reinforcement is one, and infusion the other. Reinforcement is straightforward. It strengthens a weapon without altering its property. Infusion is a more advanced form of smithing that infuses an element. Reinforcement requires titanite. Friendly as ever. Requires gems. Ah. Oh, that's that fire gem that I could have started with. I could have made a fire weapon to start with. Hurrah! I'm glad I talked to him. Wait, how is hurrah different than joy? Cold. Oh, an ember? Wait, they can't call it an ember. Ho oh! Oh, they can't call it an ember in this game. I know. It's an awful shame. Please don't give me that. Believe it or not, I'm quite I love this. 
I'm laughing along with him. Oh, by the way, if you find any Estus shards, bring them here. They can be used to reinforce either of your Estus flasks. Ooh, nice. Estus shards. Without those flasks you want for life or focus. Focus They'll points. Always stay with you. Why not treat them? I will. We'll treat them well, Andre. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, boop. what? Yo, oh, that's awesome. Okay, so it gets a little bit better. Oh, look at that. Your strength gets slightly better in the D category. Huh. Huh. Refined gem. What does this do? A refined battle axe? Raw battle axe? So this might be like before. It looks like it gives a very high base damage, loses all scaling. Refined looks like it bumps, it lowers, looks like it lowers base damage and upscaling. Fire looks like it just... Oh, removes all scaling, splits it into physical and fire. Interesting. What is even the point with this? It changes your attack power. It's the same as before. Why would they? Why did they bother with this junk? Okay. Uh, but apparently, you can just rest at a bonfire. So, what is even the point of of having this option here? The bonfire's right over there, man. I guess if you really didn't want to rest at the bonfire, you were just passing through. Pretty be careful. Pretty. I don't want to see my work squandered. <laughs> I've been getting really nervous about attacking NPCs. Just saying. I, I, I'm worried about accidentally attacking one and then screwing up my game. Dude, look at that freaking back! Jesus. This guy is muscly as all get up. <laughs> 